What's going on YouTube? It's Thomas from the Barber Style Directory and welcome back to another video. Now in this video, we're gonna do something just a little bit different. I get a lot of people in the comments asking me which clipper is best to use or what's my favorite clipper or is this clipper better for this type of hair? The answer is it doesn't matter what clipper you use. If you know what you're doing, you can get the same result. So in this video, I'm gonna fade one side using the Wall Legends and I'm gonna fade another side using the Oster Speed line or Oster Fast Speed. In the end, you won't be able to tell the difference. The fade is still gonna come out nice and clean. And that just goes to show you, it doesn't really matter which type of clipper you use, as long as you know what you're doing and as long as you follow certain steps, the result will be the same. On another note, don't forget to subscribe. We're doing a 50K subscriber giveaway, so be on the lookout for that. And without further ado, let's get into the video. Before we start this cut, I'm just showing you what we're working with. So we pretty much have a blank canvas. Now this video, it won't be more so of a tutorial, it'll be more so of a demonstration. The main thing that I want you guys to get out of this video, I just want to show you how you basically do a fade with each type of clipper. And it's up to you guys to decide which one you like better. So on the left side, I'm gonna start out by using the wall clipper. Now this is the wall legend. This is the clipper that I use in most of my videos. If these steps that I'm doing are not looking familiar to you, I have several other videos explaining these steps in more detail. However, for this video, I just want, to, I just want you guys to see the system. As I said earlier, I get a lot of people asking me which clipper is better for fading. And honestly, it's more so of a preference thing. I think it has a lot to do with what type of hair you cut more than others. For example, for, to me, wall clippers, they're good for all around hair textures. However, for Oster Fast Feeds, and we'll get to that in a second, I feel like they have pros and cons. Now in both systems, I use, uh, well the, the guards are pretty much similar, but they're just different uh, lengths, so to speak. So with wall, I use the 1 16th guard, I use the one guard, and I use the one and a half guard. And with the Oster speed lines, or fast speeds, whatever you wanna call them, I use the zero guard, the one guard, and the one and a half guard. Now my personal opinion, Wall clippers, they give a closer blend, but I feel like Oster, depending on the hair texture, I feel like they give a more smooth blend. And I, like I said, once I get to that side, I'll explain that in more detail. So like I said earlier, both systems, they use three guards. At least with this method of fading. So once again, I'm gonna, I'm fading this side using wall, and then when I do the right side, I'm gonna use Oster. And this is just a little clipper over comb work. Okay, so now we're using the Oster Fast Feed, or the, the speed line, whichever one you wanna call it. Now I will say, 
what I was saying earlier with the Oscar fast speed, I feel like you get a smoother blend depending on the hair texture. I feel like the more fine and straight the hair, the smoother blend you'll get with an Oster. But I feel like with Wall, it doesn't matter the hair texture. So if somebody has really, really, really coarse hair with Oster Fast Beads, the blend may not be as smooth. Just because to me, it doesn't cut as close. The main uh, objective of this video though, I just want you guys to know that it doesn't matter what clipper you use, you pretty much can get the same type of blend. All you have to do is know how to manipulate your tools. That's the gist that I want you guys to get out of this video. It doesn't really matter what, as long as you have a quality clipper, it doesn't really ma matter which brand you use as long as you know how to follow a system. But what I want you guys to do, after you see this fade, I want you to comment which system you like better below in the comments. So if you like wall better, comment below, I like wall better. If you like Oster better, comment you like Oster better. I just wanna see what you guys think. Hopefully this will answer questions about which clippers you want, you want to get in the future. Because you'll see that I can get the same result all around the head with different clippers. Oh, and one more thing that I like about Oster, I feel like the teeth, you can you can blend a lot long, like the, I feel like it cuts, how can I say this? The blade opens up a lot longer than wall. So you can kind of spread your blends more using Oster. So guys, don't forget to comment below, which system do you like better? Comment Wall or Oster? Right here, we're just moving on to the lineup. Like I said, this is not the focus of the video, so I'm not really gonna show you everything on the lineup. I'm just gonna show you some highlights. But I really hope you guys have enjoyed this video. So give me feedback below in the comments and let me know what you think. And if you wanna see similar videos like this, comment below. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And be sure to click that notification bell so you'll know whenever we release new content. Here we're just putting on the finishing touches. And this is pretty much the end result, guys. Thanks for watching, and I will see you guys on the next video.